How's it going everyone? JakeXVX here, back on Forza Horizon 4 once again. As many of you know, a few days ago the Update 9 information was released on livestream. In the livestream that Forza did, even though there was absolutely no direct information about the expansion 2 whatsoever, because of that stream, we now know that we were completely wrong about expansion 2. In today's video I'm going to talk about how we were wrong about Expansion 2, what it means and then I'm going to kind of explain what I think could come in Expansion 2 and also the release date. So as you know I think it was about a month ago now there was a live stream with Retro Crystal and some of the Forza Motorsport 7 guys and she gave us a little hint that there was a little event coming in the Update 9 live stream thing. And since then there's been lots and lots of clues coming out to do with little things, mini things. In their tweets they were hinting at something little, um, all the thumbnails they had had minis in them, the screenshots they were showing us of Update 9 being in the works had minis in them. Now they've never really teased us like this before so all of us including me, including AR12 Gaming, all of us thought these are hints for the expansion too. And because they've done something related to mini before like hot wheels hot wheels can be classed as mini cars we thought that the next expansion was going to be something mini as well like micro machines or hot wheels v2 or something like that so even i talked about this in one of my videos ar12 gaming actually made an entire video on this talking about what all these mini clues could have to do about expansion 2 because um, we were all pretty certain that expansion 2 was going to be something mini related not the car manufacturing mini but like mini cars however in update 9 they added a bunch of minis which i was incredibly surprised and what this tells us is all of these mini clues that they were giving us all these little clues and hints was talking about the update 9 cars and content not the expansion i actually said in the forza live stream before it started i said all this mini hype that they are doing it turns out to be a mini car pack i will upload a video of me eating a picture of ar12 nick and although it didn't really turn out to be a mini car pack just a load of new cool minis i was still wrong so if this video gets i don't know 500 likes or something then i will eat a picture of ar12 nick but anyway this video is about expansion 2 and what this tells us is expansion 2 more than likely doesn't have anything to do with mini cars now this could be seen as a good thing or a bad thing i know lots of people were excited oh we'll be getting something like hot wheels v2 or micro machines or mini cars like i think need for speed did or something i think and obviously lots of people were disappointed as well um, thinking oh I don't want mini cars I want something like Storm Island or you know what I mean well according to all of this information it does seem like expansion 2 could be anything at this point we do know it's in the works um, Forza tweeted this a few days ago that they are hard at work and they're very excited about how well it's coming along so thankfully this does open up a world of all the predictions about what expansion 2 could be it could very well be a Jim Carner world expansion a Hoodigan world expansion could be anything because all this mini hype turned out to be wrong to my surprise however when do i think this is going to be released well as i said a few months ago in one of my videos it's technically confirmed that there's going to be more than just two expansions we could be getting a third even a fourth expansion of some sort so because the forza horizon 4 lifespan has got to be an extra year compared to usual I'm expecting the gaps between expansions to be a little bit larger. Many of you will know of E3, it is the Electronic Entertainment Expo which happens yearly and lots of things get announced there and shown and stuff like that but E3 is only about a month away. It starts June the 11th on Tuesday and ends on the Friday, June 14th and I think it's very possible that within that June E3, whatever you'd call it, we could see the Horizon 4 Expansion 2 being revealed. And it would make sense because a month ago from now, we had Update 8 live stream. A couple of days ago to, from now, we had the Update 9 live stream. A month from now, we'll have the Update 10 live stream, which ties itself pretty much bang on E3. 
So if it does get announced within E3 or even the Update 10 livestream, which are basically right next to each other anyway, chances are we could then see the expansion releasing maybe within the next couple of weeks after that. So it's very possible we could see Expansion 2 being played by us within the next month and a half-ish. Now, as I did say, what I think Expansion 2 would be, I have absolutely no idea. I have my guesses, but they're probably not going to be right. I don't think anybody's going to get the guess right. Just like with Hot Wheels, nobody guessed that. Just like with Fortune Island, nobody guessed something like that. But however, I think it's entirely possible with possibly within the next month, we might receive a couple of clues or hints on what it could be. Back when Fortune Island was released, we didn't actually receive any clues or hints. However, since when that was released, which was around December, Playground Games have enjoyed giving us clues and hints on lots of different things. Here's some examples. Back when they added Mitsubishi to the game, before they even announced it, they basically spelled out the world Mitsubishi, the world, the word Mitsubishi with their tweets. The first letter of each one of their tweets, it spelt Mitsubishi. So that was a clue they gave us before they even announced it. With update 8, with update 9, they gave us a picture of them working on Twitter. They just literally posted it, working hard on update 9. And within these photos, there's all sorts of clues and hints of the features that they're going to add in the next update. And on top of that, we need to keep in mind that over the past month, they've been giving us loads of mini and little clues towards the minis that were added. So they clearly like doing it, and it's entirely possible that somewhere there might be a clue or a hint as to what Expansion 2 has in it. Try to have a look around for some clues. For example, if they do the same with what they did with Mitsubishi, they hide a clue in the first letter of each one of their tweets. Well, I wrote down like the last 15 tweets, I think, put that in an anagram solver and no words really stood out. There was, I think, semi-lethal. That doesn't really mean anything. Even the past eight tweets, there's still not really any words in there that stand out. The word wheels is in there, but I don't think the word wheels really has to mean anything. But I've looked on their Twitter. I've looked on their Instagram looked around on the forums just a little bit and there's, there's really nothing anywhere but that doesn't mean we might not see anything within the next few weeks. Now I'm actually quite excited now to be honest and more excited than I was before. Although I quite liked Hot Wheels it did feel very arcadey and if all this mini hype turned out to be towards Expansion 2 that would in probably mean that Expansion 2 is going to be quite arcadey as well. But turns out it might not be and another reason i don't think this expansion 2 is going to be anything like hot wheels is because if you check the horizon life you'll see that the trailblazer pr stunt hasn't finished yet which means expansion 2 is going to have some more trailblazers in it and trailblazers if you think properly wouldn't work on hot wheels i think this is basically all we know about expansion 2 now we know that it's probably nothing to do with what we think it's been to do with for quite a while now we do know that we might receive some clues or hints somewhere, we don't know. They seem to like to do that, so I'll be keeping my eye out. And we also know that it could be very, very soon. But please do let me know in the comment section below what you were expecting from Expansion 2. What do you think it'll be? Take a guess. And you never know, at least one of you might be right. But anyway, ladies, please leave a like if you've enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't already for more Forza Horizon 4 content. And I'll see you all later.